Malin Berdet is a young woman from the south of Sweden who wants to make a difference in this world. This summer she gave away everything she owned and started her win-win tour 2009 connecting people and projects all over the world. She was inspired to do this by a course in San Diego, USA. Uh, in the beginning of this year I went to, to San Diego to attend a leadership course, a leadership seminar. And I met leaders, amazing people from all over the world. And I found that so many people, despite different cultures, despite different things that we do, we all shared one thing, a will to make a difference. I am going to, in, to interact with the people I've met, uh, to find out what they are doing, to learn more about how they are creating the great things that they do. Uh, for example, I met a guy in Canada, uh, Ivan, who is an investment guy, and he's doing really good. And even now, when when there are so many reports that we are in an economic crisis. He's doing fabulous, he and his companies. So I'm thinking that if he can do it, so can others. If he can do it, I can learn and I can do it. And if I can learn it, so can anyone. Uh, I've met so many, so many business owners who, who are willing to, to let some of the profit work for a good cause. And, and I've been talking to, to some of them to create foundations. And then I decided, what if I just start one foundation, Global Win-Win Foundation, and then all the, the business owners who, who want to can let some of their money go into that foundation. And I have a vision of creating huge cash flows with a purpose, with a purpose of creating Global Win-Win. Have you an example of what this foundation could do and help other people with? Mm. Uh, I've been wildly inspired by a project that Clemmer & Associates does. Uh, they have let prisoners from, from different prisons in USA take the first leadership course in their leadership program. And, and they've seen some amazing results. The prisoners who usually, when they're let out of prison, they get back because they do something new, new crimes. Um, that's a, I believe, a 73% rate for the people getting back into crime. And after doing this course, only 26% does it again. And, and that's, that's just amazing. So imagine what we can do if we, if we create the cash flows to make it possible for even more prisoners to do it. Or if we let youngsters do it before they even get into prison. So, so that's one example of something that I would like to, to let the money work for. Malin Burdett is going to report from her win-win world tour every week until December 2010. This is Erika Michelson from Malmö, Sweden, reporting great news as it happens.